Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I'm back with another two week meal plan and grocery haul. I did the Walmart pickup again. As usual I will put the price on the screen for you guys and this is for two weeks. I've got everything laid out right here on my stove and my counters because my dining room is actually still a hot mess from Christmas. So I had to lay out everything right here. I do have a super ultimate clean with me coming up probably in a couple of days because I have got to get this house back. It's, it's ridiculous y'all. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the meal plan and then we will get into this giant haul. Here are my meals. I'm just using my notepad that Kristen gave me. I have misplaced my calendar. I'm not sure what I've done with it. So I just wrote down everything in this notepad. And as I've mentioned before, I do not plan um, a meal for every single day. I'll do about 10 meals for a total of 14 days because I am accounting for leftovers. And so that should take us right into the full 14 days. And like for lunch, we just keep lunch and breakfast very simple. We'll do like sandwiches for lunch or I'll pick up the stuff for salad. And then for breakfast, I always have cereal um, and I always have the stuff for pancakes. So we just keep those two meals very simple and I just plan out our dinners. And that's one way that I'm able to keep the grocery budget um, pretty low. So I'm going to go ahead and start right up here at the top. And um, as I've mentioned before, also, we don't have these in any particular order. Just kind of pick and choose what meals I want to cook on what days, what will be the most convenient. And most of these should be pretty convenient because most of them are crock pot meals. I wanted to just be able to take it easy for the next two weeks. So I have a lot of crock pot meals in this meal plan. So the first one that I have is a chicken noodle soup with garlic bread. And this is actually my aunt's recipe. Um, this is the best chicken noodle soup I've ever had in my entire life. And I've actually shared this on my channel before. I'm not sure how many videos back. It's been probably a year now since I have shared that. But I'll probably do it in my next What's for Dinner so that you guys can see again um, how I do that. And I'm going to try a corn chowder. I've never made corn chowder before. But this recipe on Pinterest that I found looked very simple. It's just a matter of dumping the ingredients in. <laughs> That's Kane. It's just a matter of dumping the ingredients in the crock pot. Then I'm going to do a roast one night with potatoes and carrots and we'll just have some rice on the side. And then one night I'm going to do this Swiss chicken and I'm going to make some green beans and yams to go on the side. This one looked really good. It kind of reminded me of like a Thanksgiving meal because you use um, chicken stuffing in it. So I'll let you guys know how that turns out. It'll probably be in my what's for dinner. As I've mentioned before, any recipes that I have links for will be linked down below for you guys. One night I want to try this chicken fajita pasta. It's kind of like a chicken spaghetti, but you make it like fajita style. So we'll see how that turns out. I'm not sure. I'm not real big on fajitas, but maybe in pasta form. We'll see. <laughs> and then one night I'm going to do chicken cheesesteak sandwiches and we'll have some french fries on the side and then one night we're going to do a tortellini soup this is a completely meatless meal at least i think it is according to what the recipe said on pinterest so we'll see um one night we're going to do breakfast i got the stuff for salad one night and then one night we're going to do pizza tonight is actually friday so i'll probably do the pizza tonight so all right let's go ahead and get into the grocery haul. So I'm going to go ahead and start with all of the produce. I got some peppers. I had actually ordered the like three pack, but they didn't have three pack. So they just gave me um, each individual one, which is fine because I still got charged for um, the three pack, which is cheaper, I think, than buying each individual pepper. Um, and then I also got some carrots for the roast. I got some more yam patties. We will have these with our Swiss chicken. And then also uh, Kane likes to eat those for lunch a lot. So I got those. And then I also picked up a cucumber for us to have on salads. Um, I got some gold potatoes for a couple of recipes. A couple of onions for a couple of recipes. I got a bag of salad. Some spinach. I got some bananas. I actually ordered the organic, um, but they didn't have them, so they gave me just the regular ones, which is fine. And I got a thing of spaghetti 
and then the bow tie pasta that'll be for the chicken noodle soup and then some elbow pasta for me to do the boys some homemade macaroni and cheese occasionally and then I got a loaf of garlic bread I love to have this kind of garlic bread with the chicken noodle soup it gets crispier than the other kind like the Texas toast and so I always like to get the loaf because like I said it gets crispier and it's perfect for dipping in the soup and then I needed some more vinegar so I just picked up a gallon of that I think it's a gallon two quarts okay um, and then I got some coffee I was completely out and these days I can't go without it um, and then I got some of this great value brand of Velveeta that's what I used to make the boys um, homemade macaroni and cheese and then I got a dozen eggs right here I needed a bottle of steak sauce I normally would not buy the generic of steak sauce There's just some things you can't buy generic it's just not the same but this is actually going in one of the recipes in the crock pot so I'm hoping it won't matter too much I'll let you guys know <laughs> and then um, we needed some more ketchup some mustard I got some milk also some cereal for the boys um, I picked them up a couple of things of yogurt they got blueberry and strawberry and then right here I got a roast for me to do the roast one night in the crock pot and then some chicken thighs also some chicken breast here I got a box of chicken stuffing that'll be for the Swiss chicken um, I needed some more cumin and some garlic powder and then I got some frozen tortellini I've never had this before so hopefully it'll be pretty good that's for the tortellini soup and then I got a thing of ham for sandwiches I got some bacon that'll go in the corn chowder I believe and right back here I got two cans of cream of celery two cans cream of mushroom and two cans cream of chicken a couple of cans of green beans one can of cream corn and then one can of whole kernel and then I needed some more cooking spray and I like to use the olive oil kind and then I also got some diced tomatoes two cans actually and then one can of crushed tomatoes a couple of different recipes called for each one so I went ahead and got both and let's see right here I got a thing of cream cheese and then we also needed some heavy whipping cream for one of the recipes I got some Swiss cheese that'll be for the Swiss chicken I also needed some more coffee creamer and then several recipes called for some chicken broth so I got three of those and then one beef broth and then here is our pizza just a regular uh, pepperoni pizza and I got two of those right here I got some chips for my husband to take to work and I actually ordered the different it was a different one um, but they didn't have it so they substituted with this and then also I went ahead and got some more um, paper towels and this is the eight pack and then I also got some sodas but I left those in the car I got a pack of Sam's Cola the 12 pack and then I also got a 12 pack of uh, mountain lightning for my husband I actually forgot to get those out so yeah I also got those all right guys so that is my grocery haul and meal plan for the next two weeks make sure that you stay tuned to see some of these recipes in my next what's for dinner I'll have that coming up very soon also got some cleaning motivation coming up for you guys so make sure that you stick around and hit that subscribe button I hope that you guys have a wonderful day night I'm gonna go ahead and try to get this up tonight it's Friday so it's like six o'clock right now hopefully I can get it uploaded before too late um anyways I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you in my next video